mods. We're just going to send this jet downstream here and give it a little bit of a blast. See what we can come up with. Uh, it's going to be a bit hard sending it upstream of this junction, but we'll, we'll go downstream first and see if we can uh, see what's going on. Hopefully solve the problem this way. And I've got to say guys, bloody day for it. Where would you rather be? Now this all seems to be flowing okay, I mean, I, it's all flowing downstream alright, I'll, I'll get the hose out and I might uh, give her a good old flush and uh, when we get to the bottom of the gap, what's going on guys? Now a few of you have been saying in the comments, Bruce, Bruce, you know, you, have you got a drain camera? We never get to see any internal pipe footage. And guys, I, I do, and I'll bloody bang the camera up this drain in a sec, but we'll just flush this drain out and um, See, this is all flowing okay. Crank a bit of pressure. Right, I might have to have a scratch around in the soil here and try and find some sort of inspection opening so that we can get the, uh, the camera up the upstream of this drain and see if there's anything going on upstream. Now, a bit of background here, guys. The owner's saying that every day the toilet bloody blocks up. At the start of the video, I flushed that down and you could see it seemed to be going okay, but it's... It's after they have showers and run a few taps for a little while that dr the drain starts filling up. Here we go guys, just a uh, couple of hundred mil more and um, we've found an inspection opening. Just there, so we'll unscrew the cap and we'll see what surprises are in store for us guys. We'll get this bloody, uh, send the camera up and um, probably bloody a big, oh look at that. It's. Wow. Alrighty guys, well um, let's get the drain camera upstream of this drain and uh, let's have a little bit of a sticky beak in the pipe and see what's going on because there's definitely sewer water just leaching out of this and um, we'll get to the bottom of it. Alright guys, we're inside the pipe now. Welcome. Let's have a little bit of a wander up this drain. You can see it's it's relatively clear. I mean, obviously the bottom of the drain here is quite dirty, but I mean that's just standard. We'll give the drain a good old blast and try and clean that uh, that build up at the bottom of the drain. But that's not the what on earth is this? It's bloody towel or something like that. It's bloody cloth or something. Yeah, well that's going to cause a block drain, guys. That is going to do it. All right. Yeah, I'm going to send this jet upstream. We'll, we'll try and uh, we'll try and jet this towel or rag or whatever. It will we'll send her backwards and try and pull her out. I just got to make sure that we don't bloody jet it too far, and we don't want to jet it past this inspection opening. I just want to get the jet just in front of the camera. There, there we are. All right, guys. We meet again inside the drain. So we'll just easy does it and we'll fire up. There we go. Wow. <laughs> Look at that. It's bloody, uh, it's filling it up like a bloody balloon, guys. Of course you've got blockages. There we go. Look at that. It's filling her up like a bloody balloon. Happy bloody birthday. Yeah, there we go. Now I'm dragging the camera backwards and then we'll fire the jet up and, and blast it towards us again. Alright. Whoa! Oh, there we go guys! I'll tell you what, bloody bang this rag in the wash and I got myself a good van rag. You know, rags always come in bloody handy guys, so uh... You know, we'll bloody we'll clean her up. As I said in the last video, guys, it won't bloody bang her in the washing machine. The missus will bloody kick my butt. All right, bit by bit, guys, we'll ease her out and get her out of this drain.
Well, guys, give yourselves a big bloody pat on the back. Look at this. The new van rag. I like a turquoise. Ha hang on a sec. They're bloody undies. <laughs> They're bloody undies. Wow. Shitty undies. Do you know what? I need a new pair as well. Looks like someone's bloody blown a hole in the back of them. I'll bloody wear them, I'll wash them, chuck them in the wardrobe, I'll pop them on tomorrow. What do you reckon, guys? I reckon they bloody, they'll bloody bloody suit me. Well, well, well. What's going on here? That is our paper mache. Now, bloody camera's in there. I've got to try and get the camera out of this mess, but uh, oh, there's also some bloody tree roots that have come out as well. So I get the multi-grips and try and just... Get a bit of this out first. Don't want this all going downstream or this will just cause a blockage further down the line. But uh, wow, she is absolutely chockers. And just a quick one, guys. I feel bloody awkward. Every time I ask it, I feel bloody awkward. But guys, if you could smash the like button and if you haven't subscribed, I'd love to have you on board. Just hit the subscribe button. Thanks very much, guys. That's enough of me bloody uh, rant. Oh, and look at this on cue. Bit of a segue. And uh, I didn't really want all those roots going down, but uh, anyway, we'll just push it into the uh, into the main drain and I'll get the jet out and give it an absolute blasting and make sure the whole line's clear. But guys, before I go on, we've got another job to go to after this. So make sure you stay tuned. All right, guys, I'm back to it again. I've just had me employee ring up and he's like, Bruce, I can't do this one. I'm dry reaching. I'm going to be sick. I was like, mate... What am I bloody paying you for, mate? You know, it's just this is what you bloody signed up for. Some people just don't bloody love this stuff. It's a bloody day for it, mate. Anyway, guys, I'm going to put me bloody arm in there. You'd swear me employee doesn't have bloody arms the way he's carrying on. You just got to feel for it, mate. You got to love it. Oh, yeah, how hard is it to take a bloody trap off, mate? You know? There, oh, there we go. Look at that. A bit of bloody pudding. Oh, me employee could have just stuck his finger in like this. Just work your bloody fingers and just get stuck in, mate. You're a man or a mouse. Basically, the whole house connects to this inspection point here, and this is where it drops down to the main sewer, the council sewer. So, give it a little bit of a plunge. Yeah. Now, there's there's tree roots down here. Now, what's going on in the past is, uh, you know, we because the house is up on the hill, we take this cap off, and she bloody explodes, mate. You know, she'll bloody all the water, bloody explode, but. I mean, and when I say all the water, I should say bloody raw sewerage, mate, because uh, I tell you, and now I'm bloody, uh, I'm probably just rambling to myself because I'm probably not even going to post this video, but if she does explode, you'll see what I mean. It's basically run for your bloody life. Whoa, here we go. Yeah, hey. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, there we go. Now, there was a little awkward moment last time. There's a bloody pool over the fence, and um, yeah, bloody hell. It's uh, in previous occasions, this sewer has bloody trickled over into the uh, into the neighbour's pool. So, look, the owner of this place said just bloody let her rip, you know. But what on earth is that? They've been pouring bloody bottles of milk down the drain. In oh, bloody hell. I hope it hasn't go oh no. Shit. Shit. Alright, let's uh Yeah, you can see this is bloody it's a slowly draining there guys. You can see there's a slight whirlpool. There's a shitload of tree roots down there. So what we're gonna do, we'll get the old rigid K1500 drain machine out guys. <laughs> Alright, you bloody larrikins, that's enough mucking around now. 
So our downstream of this inspection point should be absolutely Mickey Mouse, but I'm just going to bloody rip some of these buggers out of the line and... Yeah. So there's a bloody... I'll tell you what. There's a bloody drain slug in here. Bloody hell, putting up a bit of a fight. Here we are. Oh, look at that. You bloody... You'd put that in your sandwich, mate. Nothing like a bloody sandwich with uh, with a bit of drain slug. All right, guys, enough of the bloody chitter chatter. I reckon we got to dive back in here and uh, pull out a bit more bloody slug, mate. <laughs> I tell you what, mate. Talk about filling sandwiches. You'd be filling lunch boxes for the next year. You bloody be filling Christmas stockings at Christmas with this stuff. Wow. As I said, mate, I'm absolutely astonished that they were a flush and dunnies and Waste was getting past that. Let's get this jet back in the line and give her a blast. This shop has said that as soon as they moved in here, uh, there's been a bit of vandalism that they've noticed. You know, the previous tenants apparently left the place in an absolute state. So we'll see what's going on down here. bloody German friend, you know? The absolute weapon of a jet. German friend of the channel. Let's get him out. Well, guys, I don't know if you can tell, but I am bloody excited about this train, you know? it's And what a day for it, guys. I mean, is there a better day for it? I don't think so. I reckon it's time to get the prodder and the shovel out now. Now, um, worst case, I'll put my arm down there, but we'll see if we can get it. Alright, let's see if Mr. Proddy can get this job done and uh, feel our way out. See if there's some sort of drain down here that's blocked. All right, guys, you know what bloody time it is. I'm putting my arm down there. And no, this is not a lucky dip. This is a bit of an unlucky dip, I'd say. But what the bloody hell is this? What is a bloody pipe or something? It seems like it's bloody capped off or it's... What on earth is going on here? I'm trying to bloody pull it out of the drain. It's like it... Wow. All right. I... <laughs> hey, look at that, guys. Have we done it? I think we bloody have. Oh, guys. Pull this out the way. Give yourselves a big bloody Easter bunny pat on the bloody back. Well done. It's days like this when you think, no, it, this can't be Easter. This is bloody Christmas come early, mate. Look at this. I'm telling you guys, it's a bloody day for it. We've got severe weather warnings in Perth, Western Australia, and it's looking pretty nasty out there, mate. Just had a bloody ripper of a client ring up, and he's like, Bruce, Bruce, me bloody shop's flooding out. Can you get out here? You know, can you save me bacon? I was like, mate, absolutely not a drama. I'm on me bloody way. I'm coming to save the day, mate. Well, guys, we've probably got another 10 k's to go, but I tell you what, we are getting closer to this storm, you know. It's uh, 
She sounds like a real doozy on the radio. Well guys, I'll tell you one thing, she does not like raining in Perth, Western Australia too often. But when she does, she'll let go a month's rainfall in a couple of minutes. And guys, we're basically swimming in it. Should have pulled the boat out today. Now guys, I hate to bloody ramble on about it, but if you haven't subscribed, I'd absolutely love to have you on board. I'd love it if you'd subscribe, and once you've subscribed, just send me a comment down below and say, Bruce, I've subscribed, and I'll respond and I'll be like, you bloody legend, mate. All right, guys, less talk from me and uh, more just watching the road. This is insane. Whoa. bloody legends here we are and uh, mother nature's let loose and oh yeah speaking of mother nature this is full of leaves here this is not going to help the situation yeah oh, yeah let's enjoy a whirlpool guys Tell you what guys, it's a bloody day for it, isn't it? I mean, there's nothing better than bloody sitting here and watching a bloody whirlpool. These leaves are getting a little bit annoying though. We'll uh, get the screwdriver out and we'll, we'll take the, the grate off and might be able to enjoy an uninterrupted whirlpool. Oh, there you bloody go. Lovely. and we'll just go to town on this Jane, mate. I mean, she's going to be absolutely chock-a-block with about 20... Oh, there we go. Look at that, guys. It's like bloody Christmas, isn't it? You know, absolute bloody day for it.
grab that bit of grease there because I don't want that going down the drain because it's probably going to block the line up further downstream. It's an absolute chunk, isn't it? Try and get this bit here. Mate, an absolutely bloody... I just bloody love this stuff, mate. Anyway, let's keep going. Well, bugger me, mate. I mean, this is... This is what dreams are made of, you know? I don't know. I just don't know where I'd rather be. I know I ramble on about it, but, mate... I'm living the bloody dream. Anyway, let's keep going, guys. You know you're deep inside a bloody blockage, so any second now I reckon she's gonna rip and we're gonna have some bloody grease. Here she comes. You could bloody pack your sambos in the morning with this sort of stuff, mate. You know, bloody just get it in here.
right, you can see at the bottom of the bend there that that bloody rascal of a piece of grease has just got caught there. So we're just going to have to bloody get the plunger and smash her into bits, mate. Yeah, just got the plunger out, guys. We're just going to try and break this. <laughs> it's a bit of fun here. We're trying to smash this bit of grease down there because um, she'll just get blocked up further down the line. Let's see if I can bloody give her a bit of a smash. Oh, wasn't as effective as I was hoping, but let's carry on, guys. Absolutely astonished that this kitchen was even draining away. I mean, they'd fill the sink up and it would take bloody, take half an hour to drain away, you know, but uh, mate, that's surprising in itself. this sort of stuff isn't it you know I could bloody pop this up on eBay or something mate a memento a memento of this bloody kitchen sink here in Karamar anyway <laughs>
don't know what I'm gonna title this video guys is it like 20 minutes of kitchen sink cleaning or uh, a Bruce bloody catches an iceberg I, I don't know guys but look you know some people will find this video absolutely bloody satisfying I mean I I'm bloody satisfied clearing it guys so anywho Bloody legends, I'm nearly done now. So uh, yeah, there's me stash of gold and I'll catch you on the next one. This channel drain, she is chock a bloody block. Now the shop owner tells me this has not been cleaned in the 10 years that this door has been up and running. So we'll take these covers off and have a bit of a sticky beak inside. Yep, just as I thought. Now we're going to get the uh, the jet, we're going to give this a bloody uh, a good old blast, get this nice and shiny. Well I don't know about shiny, but we'll get her bloody clean. Now I'll take these covers off and I'll, uh, I'll stop the video for a sec, take the covers off and I'll give you the old boom, we're back. Speed the process up, this is going to be boring as batshit. And boom, we are bloody back. So anyway, guys, as you can see, taking all the covers off here, it's an absolute dog's breakfast. And I don't know about you guys, but my dog would not eat this for breakfast. Well, he'd probably, buddy, he'd roll in it. But uh, no, he wouldn't eat it. So guys, you can see this is just bloody filthy, you know. We'll get, we'll get this nice and clean. We'll sort it out. We'll get the pressure gun out, give her a good old blast, and uh, we'll have another happy customer. I'm a little bit bloody excited for this, guys. Here we go. As you can see this is starting to block up. I'm going to have to try and find the, uh, the outlet. I'd have to get me uh, me Mr. Proddy device out and start trying to prod for this. Out is it down here? Maybe. Now nah, I have to get the prodder out, guys. The outlet pipe could be bloody anywhere. Here we go, Mr. Proddy will save the day. Now we'll just run this along here because down the bottom somewhere, guys, there's going to be the outlet pipe. As soon as we find it, we'll um, we'll give it a blast because it's uh, there's all this waste. It's just obviously you're getting getting caught up in the outlet. No point in going any further until we find it.
Yeah, of course. Of course it's going to be right on the end of the other side. Yeah, there it is. Let's get the jet back out and give her a blast. Boom, there we go guys, we've hit the jackpot. Now we can do our thing. Let's get this nice and clean. I can hear you guys, I can hear you. You're going, Bruce, Bruce, you need more pressure. More pressure you want, more pressure you'll bloody get, guys. Pour a little bit of sanitizer down here, guys, and uh, look, that is that is looking so much bloody better. Look at that; it actually flows flows down bloody hill. And on cue, I've got another call coming in. Oh, look, I'll uh, I'll hang on. I'll hang up on that for now. Yeah, there's nothing worse than bloody uh, you know paying for a service and your tradesman's on the phone. It's something that I'll refuse to do, guys. I've got a little button. I'll push it and it will send him a message saying I'll call you back soon.